Hello, so welcome to another five minute preset. Uh, today we're going to look at a really lush kind of ambient clean, which is a lot of fun to play. Uh, something a bit different today, we're not going to use an amp. So let's go. So quick build, an in and an out, as always, we'll connect both ends together and we'll add our ingredients. So today we're going to be looking at using a reverb and we'll use a delay in front of that. And right at the start, we'll use a compressor. And today, something a bit different, we're gonna be using a parallel block, a parallel chain here. And in, in there, we're gonna be using a tremolo, so the pan trem block. We can use a second delay, right there. And we'll also be using the plex delay block. So this will be in parallel before the reverb. Again, we're not using that. It might look a bit strange, but trust me, it sounds delicious. <laughs> so let's connect the parallel chain. So for that, we'll click here, up to there. And here's a trick when you've got a few blocks that you've put together. You don't actually have to connect each one separately. You can select the last block like this and then connect it to the, the first one like that. And then it connects both together. And then we'll connect this down to there. So we've got a parallel chain running into the reverb. So the point of the compressor is sort of uh, replacing not our amp block, but the feel, the compression. Because if we don't have the compressor, it can be quite brash and we need that kind of soft uh, touch, I guess, or soft feel to the note. So that's why that's there. So before we do anything, I'll first turn the mix up on the parallel blocks. So on each one, We'll turn the mix up to 100% as we don't want to hear a mix of a dry signal. It, it just won't work. And then we'll get to the rest of our ingredients. So as it's a lush ambient turn, we're going to be using a very large reverb. We'll take a large haul. We'll bump the time up. We'll decay up to six seconds. And we'll even put the mix up to 35%. And something that's important, especially in this patch, is to EQ the reverb. Otherwise, we'll get a lot of low end buildup. So we'll go to the EQ tab and we'll go for a value of 150 on the low cut. So with everything running, I haven't changed any of the blocks. This is what we get. So you already get a sense of the vibe that we're, we're going for, um, but we can tweak this to make it sound even more uh, immersive. So for our first delay block, which is going straight into the reverb, so this is not on the parallel chain, it's this one, we'll go for a deluxe mind guy, which is a stereo, or in this case, it's a stereo deluxe memory man. Important thing here is to, is this the right post delay to give a bit more width We'll bump that up to four. We're going to be using a feedback of 30%. And for the tap tempo, we'll use a quarter note. So everything for the second delay and this stuff is more in sync. Not the band, but it's, it'll be more in sync, 120 BPM. And this is what we get. <laughs> we're gonna sort these blocks out and also bring the sound more together and make it more cohesive. So for the tremolo block, uh, I really like the bias trem on this. Uh, again, we're gonna go for a quarter note on the tempo. And for the depth, you can do that to taste, but I'm finding that around the sort of between 40 and 60 mark is quite nice. This is what we get with that. So what you gain is a bit of movement within the signal along with the dry signal that's carrying over the delay. So you get this nice depth to the note. And then for our second delay that's up here, we're going to use the 2290 with modulation. And we're going to do the same thing as on this delay. So first things first, quarter note, tap tempo. We'll have a four millisecond right post delay. 
we'll bump the feedback up to 30%. And this is what we get. Which is already sound quite nice. But the final tweaks are actually in this plex delay block because this is where we get the kind of granular, uh, I guess, really warm, fuzzy feeling, I guess, or at least uh, I find that. And um, the plex delay block on itself, it gives a cleaner sound, but we can actually use the granular echoes, which is what we're going to go for on this, which gives a darker, more analog. I guess tone or a much darker tone. This is what this sounds like. Which is already sounding really nice, I think. And what we can do, given it's a parallel block uh, or a parallel chain, sorry, is that we can pull this back depending on taste. So how much you want to blend in. You can either blend on both blocks. So you basically choose via the level how much of each effect that you want to hear going through that chain and at the end, of course. I like to just change this one to start. So we'll put that at, say, minus 10. This is what we get. Or we can put both of them down a bit, which can be a nice blend as well. So if we take minus five here, I'll take minus five here on the level. This is what we get. which is already really nice. Um, one thing I'll add is if you're using humbuckers or if you're getting way too much high end, you can use a filter block at the end to sort of shape the, the tone at the end, just using the low cut and the high cut. I use the values that I usually use on a lot of, say, cab blocks. So 80 for the low cut, 10K for the high cut. And it's it maybe subtle, but it does make a difference. And for some final tweaks, I'd also suggest uh, pulling off some low end on both of the de delay blocks. So in the delay block EQ tab, we'll pull off 150 hertz on both of them. So EQ tab on the second delay, 150 hertz as well. Cleans up the low end, so you'll get a lot more um, clarity, I guess, which will help on the high end and getting that kind of ambient, lush kind of vibe. <laughs> So there we go. I hope uh, this was useful. Uh, I've actually put a download link to this preset in the description, but you can also build it from scratch. Uh, choice is yours. As always, love to hear your comments on this sort of content. If you like this, please drop a like and subscribe. Definitely helps me out. Thanks a lot.